I'm going to show you how to do gel transfers. What you're going to need to do this is your substrate, whether it's a canvas or masonite surface, soft gel, and a scraper or paintbrush. You're also going to need a brayer, water, and sandpaper. Your image, and remember that your image is going to be reversed and this image can be a magazine or any toner based image and also the light areas of the image are transparent the dark areas are more opaque let's go okay I start by spritzing the image with water I can also soak the water under the sink that's a personal call um, and the reason I do this is so that the paper will dry at the same rate as the gel. So I now have my surface here and I'm going to put on soft gel gloss and I can choose to cover the whole surface or just parts of the surface. I think I want some areas that um, the image doesn't come off on. So now I flip my image on its back, put it on the surface, and with my brayer, I'm going to make sure it's adhered tightly to that surface. Let me just wipe that off a bit. Okay, now because the paper is wet and the uh, soft gel medium, soft gel gloss is um, also wet, they now will dry at the same rate. The trick to this is letting this dry thoroughly. If you don't let it dry thoroughly, what happens is it's not sticky and the paper will just all come off without leaving that ink on the surface. So let's wait a while and let it dry thoroughly and I'll come back and show you how to take it off. Okay, now that it's thoroughly dried, what you will need is water and sandpaper. And you're going to sand the back of the image. And why you're doing this, the reason you're doing this is because it breaks up the surface on the back and makes it easier for the water. Okay, now we spritz it with water. And you can, if you want to work a little faster, you can get a sponge. And uh, once the water is penetrated, what you're doing is rubbing off the paper on the back. And you start to see your image coming through. Okay, right here you can start to see that palm tree. And once all the paper is off, you'll see the image on top of the color. Now that I've uh, rubbed all the paper off the back of the image, the ink has uh, stuck to the surface of my substrate. And you can kind of see the gold leaf behind it. There's the pattern that I had painted on before. But here is the type from the magazine. So now I would go back in and probably put paint on top of this and work it some more. But it gives me a great start and if you have the right image you could have your finished piece right now. So that's what it is. It's gel transfers.